Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, my lovely Scorpios. This is going to be your daily reading for your general energies and also for your love energy Scorpios. So, and I'm going to take cards for the message from your person today, including your love energies, your daily energies and the message for your person today, okay? So, let's see what's coming up, guys. see what's coming up for your gentle energies first how is your day going to be any new adventures for today or is it going to be a normal day let's just find out scorpios You guys may be like really opening up yourselves to people around you or you're kind of in this energy where even though like you feel like you're not the best person in this whole universe, you just kind of open up to people who you feel close to, okay? You can be misinterpreted, I mean misinterpreted by the people. So just don't tell everyone about you guys, okay? Maybe people may not think like you think today. So maybe people may take it in a different way, especially the people you stay with today. So make sure Scorpios that you don't trust everyone around you and you don't talk about your deepest sick energy or like something that has made you feel so bad to people around you. Okay. So that's what I see here, guys. With a king of wands, with the eight of pentacles, you're just going to be this person who just has, what is it? You're not going to accept people in your lives who are not um, coming under your values or you have like certain values and certain things that you follow and if people don't come under that category, I don't think you're going to accept these people, okay? You're just going to be so keen on your standards or so keen on your belief system and you're not going to compromise for anyone okay even though if you're not going to compromise for even though you've known this person for two or three years and they hid something from you and this person is actually opening up to you you will just be like i don't want you in my life you should have told me before like seriously you're going to be this person who doesn't who will not accept if you don't feel it is up to your level or you don't feel like they're up to your standards or something like that okay i hope you understand the energy so that's how you're going to be today you may be um not so talkative around your friends or you may be like not really talking to people you will be this person who's really silent today or in your environment at least people are going to view you as the silent person who just does whatever he or she does in general and you're just going to be in that introverted energy okay you don't want to open up you don't want to talk much today i also see here that you are caught up in your dreams and your thoughts and you're going to be like really thinking a lot uh, okay that's what i get here you're going to be dreaming realizing a lot of things and you'll just be this person who's lost okay who's lost and you don't know how to have this new beginning you don't know how to start life again or you really are confused with the life in general and you really don't know what to do okay You're just confused today 
even though people are going to treat you well even though people are going to listen to you you're just going to be this person who doesn't want that okay you just want something extra from people around you you don't want attention because you're already getting attention you don't want them to talk to you always or you don't want that kind of a bond but instead you want people to relate to you okay and when you feel like they cannot relate to you it's just maybe sad okay you feel like sad maybe because you think like this person cannot relate to you okay that's what i see here So with the eight of pentacles, with the nine of cups, and with the five of swords. What I'm also getting here is that today you will be always dreaming. You might be even thinking of circumstances that can never happen and be scared. Okay, so you feel like some people in your life expect certain things from you, and you feel like you cannot give them these certain things. So you just want to come out of that situation. or you just have this kind of a feeling with these people okay let's see what's coming up for the message from your person okay so what is the message from your person today scorpio a message from your person it's going to be a very long reading for you all as i told you for last week i did a 20 minute reading for you scorpios and this week i'm also going to do a 20 minute reading okay today So we have a message from your person. Okay, your person has to like tell a lot of things to you. They feel like you you were in. They feel they really feel like you were in. You were in a very bad situation, and even you don't recognize it. Okay, like maybe when you explain your life to this person or. when you're opening up to this person they kind of find you a little bit crazy they think like you may be in that sick situation but then you itself don't know that okay they really feel like you're a very innocent person who cannot really who doesn't really know what was happening around you or like they view you as a very innocent person who's kind of like stuck and even though some things may have happened you kind of don't know that okay or this person really thinks that you are a very different person you're a very different and a very unique person that's what i see here okay what is some uh, they view you as a person who's really mature at the same time immature okay you may be mature in some things and totally like a kid in other things so that's it i see here your person may also be thinking a lot guys and the message they have for you is like they want you forever like maybe the kind of possessive okay that's what i see here you might be talking about your loved one to this person or like how your rel past relationships were or something like that to this person okay and they really kind of feel this possessiveness for you they really cannot accept some things okay so this person may go into this devil energy they might like start having addictions because they cannot actually face the truth your person is definitely having a strong pisces in their chart or someone who's always in that dreamy energy okay scorpio cancer pisces taurus virgo capricorn i see here also Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Okay, you're dealing with any of these signs, even Leo, Sagittarius, but mostly these signs. Okay, I see here that your person is really 
they cannot accept some things in life and they really feel sick and they don't really know what to do in a particular situation they feel like things cannot like go right for them okay they just want things to go right okay whatever they do they just feel like they cannot accept you no matter what or it's just the feeling that they have is they're they're the ones who just want you for themselves or they just they just cannot accept some things that you are kind of opening up okay and your person may have maybe traumatic situations before like they were in some kind of traumatic situation maybe like they lost their loved ones or maybe like something really traumatic happened okay they never expected some things like this to happen but then they really when you open up to them they kind of feel like you will also leave them okay they may have the feeling that you would leave them and they may like really think that you will not stay with them okay so that's what i see here so this person is kind of thinking a lot about it they're like always thinking okay the whole day they're going to think about what to do in this situation because they're not actually they're always in this dreamy energy always like 24 hours this person if you leave them they will dream about you or they will they've even planned everything with you i see here but when when it's like they have to come into this reality and they have to think in a very like how they should be practical and they have to think in a practical way this person really cannot do that okay they find it really hard to stay pra practical and therefore when you kind of explain about the truth or about the reality that kind of happened in your past okay but this person cannot accept that and that might lower this person okay they might feel really unwanted they will just feel they really feel like you don't need them or they might get a lot of inferior energy i see here because they just are stuck in that energy okay they cannot step into reality but once they step into reality they're just they cannot come out of it that's how pisces are like pisces go to ways guys if you're dealing with a pisces it's definitely like i think you can definitely relate to my reading okay or someone who has a strong pisces in their chart someone who has a strong taurus in their chart this person is really possessive okay that's what i see here and maybe that is the only reason that caused your breakup or something like that may have like led to the situation and this person today they really want you to be there so like they just want to have this sad they just are sad i also see that they're sad they may hurt you while texting or this person may like talk something or may make you feel a little low it's because they are feeling like that and they don't know how to give that energy back to you and they really feel like if they make you feel this way then you would be you would feel much more better okay that's what i see here and this person you just have to understand that you didn't do anything wrong it was just your past and like what is it you didn't do anything wrong even though this person is kind of treating you very bad or manipulative or they treated you really bad they were manipulative it was not your mistake scorpius you just have to understand that this person can only they were like that because of their own circumstances and their own situation and now they clearly understand that they were possessive on you and that is why it continuously led to them a series of events and definitely like this breakup happened and they're like finding out about all these things i get that also for some of you who are not in contact with your person this may be the energy okay your person may be like was so possessive on you they started like creating something or the other maybe they started making fun of you and they just started pulling out some issues from your life and started talking about those issues and they created up a lot of messy situations or they even like what to say they kind of 
were not respecting you when they left you is because they didn't know how to show that what do you say how that feeling i mean they want you to feel a little possessive on them and they wanted this secure feeling maybe they were not getting that secure feeling maybe because they were not giving that secure feeling to you but then i also see here that this person really it was their mistake okay you don't have to really worry because i don't see it's your mistake definitely if you're dealing with a taurus if you're dealing with a fixed sign or if you're dealing with a pisces if scorpio cancer again taurus Virgo, capricorn leo aries it was not your mistake it was this person's mistake that i can see here very clearly okay so you don't have to worry or think too much and you don't have to have this negative feeling and all of that because it is definitely not your mistake okay just be happy guys this person will definitely come out of this energy but right now what they're realizing today is that you maybe were meant to be your soul mates and that's why you met at some point but then they also understand why this overall situation happened between you and what caused this breakup is maybe because of the possessiveness between you okay so i hope you got the energies guys today i hope this reading really resonated with you all scorpios i'll just also pull out three cards for my cross watchers okay for your energy so that all of my cross watchers can watch for the scorpio energies okay for my cross watchers what is coming up for the scorpio energies let's just find out scorpio love energies okay so this is uh, these three cards are only for those who are in the separation state and wants to know about their scorpios how they feel about them or something like that okay so for my cross watchers with these cards i see here that with the ten of wands scorpios really want commitment i see here with the tower maybe something really changed in the environment that may have changed the situation that they were in or something really happened okay i see a drastic change here with the tower or something maybe you had this breakup and it was really sad for both of you not just for one of you like i see here but then you're you're able to come out of that situation and that's a good energy again with the empress again the same energy what i'm getting here is that scorpios are really kind and loving and caring so if you really want a scorpio to be kind loving and caring cross watchers you have to be kind loving and caring okay so if you stay like that then scorpio is all yours but once you hurt a scorpio that's like you cannot go back to them okay because they won't be ready for a second chance or something like that so that's what i see here for you all my cross watchers so this is all i have for you guys and again for my cross watchers i see here that right now scorpio is bonding a committed relationship so if you are ready for the commitment you can go towards them if you're not ready for the commitment then i think you shouldn't go towards them because right now all they expect is a committed relationship from someone and they just want a true friendship kind of a situation first okay so that's what i see here so thank you all so much for watching my lovely Scorpios and my cross watchers. Your lucky color for today is orange Scorpios and your lucky crystal for today is amethyst. Bye guys, I'll see you all tomorrow.